time. It's two o'clock. It's two fifteen. It's a quarter after two. It's two thirty. It's half past two. It's two forty-five. It's a quarter to three. Months of the year: January. February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September. October, November, December. Seasons, spring, summer, fall, autumn, winter. What are they going to do tomorrow? Listen to the model. What's Fred going to do tomorrow? He's going to fix his car. Do exercises one through six. You will hear the correct line after you speak. One. We'll begin. What's Jenny going to do tomorrow? She's going to paint her bathroom. Two. We'll begin. What are Kathy and Dave going to do tomorrow? They're going to wash their windows. Three. We'll begin. What's Tony going to do tomorrow? He's going to cook. Four. We'll begin. What are you and your brother going to do tomorrow? We're going to study. Five. You begin. What's Andrew going to do tomorrow? He's going to clean his apartment. Six. You begin. What's Ashley going to do tomorrow? She's going to listen to music. They're going to the beach. Listen to the model. What are Mr. and Mrs. Brown going to do tomorrow? They're going to the beach. Do exercises one through four. You will hear the correct line after you speak. We'll begin. One. What's Anita going to do this morning? She's going to the library. Two. What are Steve and Brenda going to do tonight? They're going dancing. Three. What's Fernando going to do tomorrow evening? He's going to a concert. Four. What are you and your friends going to do tomorrow afternoon?
We're going to a baseball game. When are you going to? Listen to the first model. When are you going to wash your clothes? I'm going to wash them this week. Listen to the second model. When are you going to fix our doorbell? I'm going to fix it next Friday. Listen to the third model. When are you going to cut your hair? I'm going to cut it this summer. Listen to the fourth model. When are you going to call the plumber? I'm going to call him right now. Do exercises one through eight. In your answer, use tomorrow. You will hear the correct line after you speak. We'll begin. One. When are you going to clean your garage? We're going to clean it tomorrow. Two. When are you going to call your grandmother? I'm going to call her tomorrow. Three. When are you going to fix your bicycle? I'm going to fix it tomorrow. Four. When are you going to visit us? We're going to visit you tomorrow. Five. When are you going to wash your car? I'm going to wash it tomorrow. Six. When are you going to plant flowers this year? I'm going to plant them tomorrow. Seven. When are you going to write to your Aunt Martha? I'm going to write to her tomorrow. Eight. Mr. Smith, when are you going to iron those pants? I'm going to iron them tomorrow. Listening. Listen and choose the words you hear. One. When are you going to buy a computer? Tomorrow. Two. When are your neighbors going to move? Next November. Three. When are you going to visit me? Next month. Four. When are you going to do your laundry? This evening. Five. When are you going to begin your vacation? This Sunday. Six. When are we going to go to the concert? This Thursday. Seven. When are you going to wash the windows? This afternoon. Eight. When is she going to get her driver's license? Next week. Nine. When is your daughter going to finish college? Next winter. Ten.
10. When is the landlord going to fix the kitchen sink? At once. Happy New Year. Listen. It's December 31st, New Year's Eve. Ruth and Larry Carter are celebrating the holiday with their children, Nicole and Jonathan. The Carters are a very happy family this New Year's Eve. Next year is going to be a very good year for the entire family. Next year, Ruth and Larry are going to take a long vacation. They're going to visit Larry's brother in Alaska. Nicole is going to finish high school. She's going to move to San Francisco and begin college. Jonathan is going to get his driver's license. He's going to save a lot of money and buy a used car. As you can see, the Carters are really looking forward to next year. It's going to be a very happy year for all of them. Happy New Year! What's the forecast? Listen to the model. What are you going to do tomorrow? I don't know. I want to go swimming, but I think the weather is going to be bad. Really? What's the forecast? The radio says it's going to rain. That's strange. According to the newspaper, it's going to be sunny. I hope you're right. I really want to go swimming. Do exercises one through six. You will hear the correct line after you speak. One. We'll begin. What are you going to do tomorrow? I don't know. I want to have a picnic. But I think the weather is going to be bad. Really? What's the forecast? The radio says it's going to rain. That's strange. According to the newspaper, it's going to be nice. I hope you're right. I really want to have a picnic. Two. We'll begin. What are you going to do tomorrow? I don't know. I want to go to the beach, but I think the weather is going to be bad. Really? What's the forecast? The radio says it's going to be cloudy. That's strange. According to the newspaper, it's going to be sunny. I hope you're right. I really want to go to the beach. Three. We'll begin. What are you going to do tomorrow? I don't know. I want to go sailing, but I think the weather is going to be bad. Really? What's the forecast? The radio says it's going to be foggy. That's strange. According to the newspaper, it's going to be clear. I hope you're right. I really want to go sailing.
Four. You begin. What are you going to do tomorrow? I don't know. I want to go skiing, but I think the weather is going to be bad. Really? What's the forecast? The radio says it's going to be warm. That's strange. According to the newspaper, it's going to snow. I hope you're right. I really want to go skiing. Five. You begin. What are you going to do tomorrow? I don't know. I want to work in my garden, but I think the weather is going to be bad. Really? What's the forecast? The radio says it's going to be very hot. That's strange. According to the newspaper, it's going to be cool. I hope you're right. I really want to work in my garden. Six. You begin. What are you going to do tomorrow? I don't know. I want to take my children to the zoo, but I think the weather is going to be bad. Really? What's the forecast? The radio says it's going to be cold. That's strange. According to the newspaper, it's going to be warm. I hope you're right. I really want to take my children to the zoo. Hi, folks. Oh, hello. Hi. What are your names? I'm Alice, and he's Fred. Tell me, Alice, what are you going to do tomorrow? I'm going to work in the yard. What's Fred going to do tomorrow? He's going to fix his car. Yes, I'm going to fix my car, and she's going to work in the yard. What's the weather going to be like? It's going to be beautiful. Well, have a nice day. Thanks. You too. Hello. Hi. Hello. Tell me, what are you going to do tomorrow? We're going to clean our house. I see. Yes, I'm going to clean the living room, and she's going to clean the basement. No, Harry, you're going to clean the basement, and I'm going to clean the living room. He's going to clean the basement. How about your children? Are they going to help? Oh, yes. They're going to clean the attic. Well, happy cleaning. Thanks. Bye. Who is that? I don't know. What are you going to do today? I'm going to the library. Are you going to the library this morning? Yes, I'm going there right now. What are you going to do this afternoon? I'm going to my chemistry class. I see. Don't forget your chemistry book over there. My chemistry book? Oh, yes. Thanks for reminding me. You're welcome. Tell me, what are you going to do this evening? I'm going to a concert with some friends. And then we're all going out for a late dinner. Do you have your concert ticket? Yes, here it is. You know, you're going to be tired tonight. That's for sure. Well, have a nice day and enjoy the concert. Thanks. What are Mr. and Mrs. Brown going to do tomorrow? They're going to the beach. Don't forget your sunglasses. They're right here. Are they going to the beach tomorrow morning? You know, Helen, everybody's going to the beach tomorrow morning. You're right, Howard. Let's go tomorrow afternoon. No, I don't think so. I think they're going to the beach tomorrow afternoon. What are they going to do tomorrow evening? 
I'm going to wear this at the restaurant tomorrow evening. What do you think? It's fine. Do you like this jacket and tie? It's perfect. They're going to a fancy restaurant near the beach. Are they going back home tomorrow night? Don't forget your pajamas and toothbrush. I have them right here. No, they're going to a hotel. Well, I think that's everything. I think so. We're going to have a great time at the beach tomorrow. It's going to be wonderful. Lance. Lance. Hey, what's going on? Lance, when are you going to wash your clothes? I'm going to wash them this week. <laughs> Lance, are you really going to wash them this week? Well, maybe next week. Next week? How about this week? Now, come on, Theodore. Calm down. There's no reason to get angry. I'm going to wash my clothes sometime this month. I promise. This month? Lance, I don't believe this. Are you serious? You're right. This is a very busy month. I'm going to wash my clothes next month, and that's a promise, Theodore. Next month? Lance, I don't believe you. I don't think you're going to wash them next month. In fact, I don't think you're going to wash them this year. Whoa, what are you doing? What do you think I'm doing? I'm going to wash your clothes. You're going to wash my clothes? Yes, I'm going to wash your clothes because you're not going to wash them. I know it. You're never going to wash them. Gee, Theodore, I don't know what to say. Don't say anything. Tell you what, Theodore. I'm going to make you a promise. Next year, I'm going to wash your clothes. <laughs> You're going to what? Next year, I'm going to wash your clothes. And that's a promise. <laughs> sure, Lance. It's a promise! Edward, what are you doing? I'm fixing the sink. You're fixing the sink? Yes. Edward, come on. You can't fix the sink. Sure I can. When are you going to call the plumber? I'm going to call him right now. Edward, I think we need a plumber immediately. At once. You're right. I'm going to call the plumber right away. I'm going to be very busy next week. It's going to be a very busy week. Do you want to know how busy I'm going to be? I'm going to tell you right now. Next Sunday, I'm going to visit my mother and father. My mother's going to make soup, and my father's going to cook chicken on the barbecue. They're going to ask me about my work. I'm going to ask them about their friends. We're going to have a very nice time. Next Monday, I'm going to go to work. I'm not going to drive my car to work, because I'm going to bring my car to the mechanic, and he's going to fix it. I'm going to take the bus to work. After work, I'm going to take the bus to the garage and get my car. The mechanic's going to give me my bill, and I'm going to be upset, because it's going to cost a lot of money. Next Tuesday, I'm going to get to work early because I'm going to talk to my boss. I'm going to ask my boss for a raise. She's going to say, no, maybe next year. And I'm going to say, okay, and walk out, and I'm going to be sad. Next Wednesday, I'm going to fly to Chicago. I'm going to go to a meeting in the morning. I'm going to have lunch with some people, and I'm going to go to another meeting in the afternoon. I'm going to fly home in the evening, and I'm going to be very tired. Next Thursday, I'm going to write a report about my meetings in Chicago. I'm not going to write about the lunch because the lunch isn't going to be very good. I'm going to type the report on my computer, I'm going to print it on my printer, and I'm going to give it to my boss. Next Friday, I'm not going to go to work right away. I'm going to go to the dentist. My dentist is going to look at my teeth, and his assistant's going to clean them. I'm going to be a little nervous, but my dentist is going to tell me, don't worry, I'm not going to hurt you, everything's going to be okay. And I'm going to believe him, because my dentist is a very nice person. Next Saturday, I'm going to relax and have fun. I'm going to go jogging. Then I'm going to go bowling. I'm going to have lunch at my favorite restaurant. Then, in the afternoon, I'm going to go sailing. Then I'm going to go shopping. In the evening, I'm going to go to a movie with some friends, and then we're going to go dancing. Yes, it's going to be a very busy week, but I guess I like it that way. Oh, I'm going to be late. I'm going to go now. Bye.
Well, just two more minutes and it's a brand new year. Just two more minutes. How about that? This sure is a great New Year's party. It sure is. It's a very nice party. Are I'm you looking, looking forward, forward to... to... <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Go ahead. Are you looking forward to next year? Yes, I am. How about you? Me too. Next year is going to be a great year. In January, I'm going to start a new job. That's interesting. I'm going to start a new job in February. How about that? In March, I'm going to California to visit my brother. Really? I'm going to California in April to visit my sister. Well, how do you like that? <sighs> May is going to be an exciting month. I'm going to buy a new car in May. What a coincidence. I'm going to buy a new car in June. <sighs> I can't believe it. It's amazing. <laughs> Are you going to go on a summer vacation next year? Yes. I'm going to Canada in July. Don't tell me you're going to Canada, too. <laughs> I sure am. I'm going to go there in August. I always go to Canada in August, every year. <laughs> September is going to be a very important month. In September, I'm going to acting school. No. You're kidding. I'm going to acting school in October. That's incredible! So what's going to happen with you in November? November? Well, um, I'm going to get married in November. You're going to what? I'm going to get married in November. Oh. I suppose you're going to get married in December, right? December? Uh, no. I'm not going to get married in December. Look at the time. It's 12 o'clock. Happy New Year! Happy New Year! Yeah. Happy New Year. What time is it? Listen to the model. What time does the movie begin? It begins at 8 o'clock. At 8 o'clock? Oh, no! We're going to be late. Why? What time is it? It's 7.30. We have to leave right now. I can't leave now. I'm shaving. Please try to hurry. I don't want to be late for the movie. Do exercises one through four. You will hear the correct line after you speak. One. We'll begin. What time does the football game begin? It begins at three o'clock. At three o'clock? Oh, no. We're going to be late. Why? What time is it? It's 2.30. We have to leave right now. I can't leave now. I'm taking a bath. Please try to hurry. I don't want to be late for the football game. 2. We'll begin. What time does the bus leave? It leaves at 7.15. At 7.15? Oh, no. We're going to be late. Why? What time is it? It's 6.45. We have to leave right now. I can't leave now. I'm packing my suitcase. Please try to hurry. I don't want to be late for the bus.
Three. We'll begin. What time does the train leave? It leaves at 5.30. At 5.30? Oh, no. We're going to be late. Why? What time is it? It's 5.15. We have to leave right now. I can't leave now. I'm taking a shower. Please try to hurry. I don't want to be late for the train. 4. You begin. What time does the concert begin? It begins at 8 o'clock. At 8 o'clock? Oh, no! We're going to be late. Why? What time is it? It's 7.45. We have to leave right now. I can't leave now. I'm looking for my pants. Please try to hurry. I don't want to be late for the concert. How to say it? Asking the time. Listen to the first conversation. What time is it? It's four o'clock. Listen again. What's the time? It's four o'clock. Listen to the second conversation. Can you tell me the time? Yes, it's four o'clock. Listen again. Do you know the time? Yes, it's four o'clock. The fortune teller. Listen. Walter is visiting Madame Sophia, the famous fortune teller. He's wondering about his future. And Madame Sophia is telling him what is going to happen next year. According to Madame Sophia, next year is going to be a very interesting year in Walter's life. In January, he's going to meet a very nice woman and fall in love. In February, he's going to get married. In March, he's going to take a trip to a warm, sunny place. In April, he's going to have a bad cold. In May, his parents are going to move to a beautiful city in California. In June, there's going to be a fire in his apartment building, and he's going to have to find a new place to live. In July, his friends are going to give him a DVD player for his birthday. In August, his boss is going to fire him. In September, he's going to start a new job with a very big salary. In October, he's going to be in a car accident, but he isn't going to be hurt. In November, he's going to be on a television game show and win a million dollars. And in December, he's going to become a father. According to Madame Sophia, a lot is going to happen in Walter's life next year. But Walter isn't sure he believes any of this. He doesn't believe in fortunes or fortune tellers. But in January, he's going to get a haircut 
and buy a lot of new clothes. Just in case Madame Sophia is right, and he meets a wonderful woman and falls in love. What's the weather? Rain or shine, we'll be together, side by side. Now, here's the world weather forecast from Side by Side TV News with Side by Side meteorologist Maria Hernandez. Hello, everybody. Let's take a look at tomorrow's weather forecast around the world. It's going to be sunny in Puerto Rico. It's going to be cloudy in Venezuela. All our friends in France, get your umbrellas ready. It's going to rain. It isn't going to rain very hard in Poland. It's just going to drizzle. It's going to snow in Ukraine. It's going to be clear in Morocco. And be careful driving in Portugal. It's going to be foggy. And looking at some temperatures around the world. It's going to be hot in Saudi Arabia. It's going to be warm in Thailand. Wear a light jacket in Korea. It's going to be cool. And put on a heavy coat in Lithuania. It's going to be cold. Now here's the weather forecast for other parts of the world. the world weather forecast from Side by Side TV News. I'm Maria Hernandez. Have a nice day. What are you going to do tomorrow? I don't know. I want to go swimming, but I think the weather is going to be bad. What's the forecast? The radio says it's going to rain. That's strange. According to the newspaper, it's going to be sunny. I hope you're right. I really want to go swimming. Excuse me. What time is it? It's 11 o'clock. Pardon me. Do you have the time? Yes, it's 11.15. What's the time? It's 11.30. Excuse me. Can you tell me the time? Certainly. It's 11.45. What time do you have? It's 12 o'clock. What time does the movie begin? It begins at 8 o'clock. At 8 o'clock? Oh, no, we're going to be late. Why? What time is it? It's 7.30. We have to leave right now. Oh, but I can't leave now. I'm shaving. Please try to hurry. I don't want to be late for the movie. Oh! Excuse me. What time does the game begin? It begins at a quarter after two. A quarter after two? Yes, that's right. Thanks. This is the final boarding call for Amtrak train number 54 to New York. Train number 54, all aboard, please. Pardon me, are you on the train to New York? Yes, I am. What time does the train leave? It leaves at half past five. Half past five? Thanks. Excuse me. What time does the flowers in Priscilla's garden start? The flowers in Priscilla's garden? I have no idea. I'm seeing Space Wars. Let me take a look. It begins at a quarter to eight. A quarter to eight? Thanks. What time is it? It's 12 o'clock, dear. Twelve noon? No, don't be silly. It's night time. It's twelve midnight. Twelve midnight? Yes, dear. It's time for bed. Oh.
any day, any week, any month, any year, I'm going to wait right here to be with you. In the spring, in the summer, in the winter or the fall, just call, I'm waiting here to be with you. Away from January, February, March, April, May, June, and July, August, September, October, and November, and all of December. I'm gonna wait. It's one o'clock, a quarter after, it's half past one, a quarter to two, and I'm gonna wait right here. To be with you Any day Any week Any month Any year I'm gonna wait Right here To be with you Yes I'm gonna wait Right here To be with Pronunciation. Going to and want to. Listen, then say it. I'm going to study. It's going to rain. We want to go swimming. They want to leave. Say it, then listen. He's going to cook. They're going to paint. I want to read. We want to go to the beach. End of chapter 14 Build your vocabulary. Occupation I'm an architect. I'm a carpenter. I'm a cashier. I'm a farmer. I'm a lawyer. I'm a painter. I'm a pilot. I'm a translator. I'm a waiter. I'm a waitress. Culture. People in different cultures think of time in different ways. In your culture, do people arrive on time for work? Do people arrive on time for appointments? Do people arrive on time for parties? Tell about time in your culture. Listening. Thank you for calling the Multiplex Cinema. Listen and match the theaters and the movies. Thank you for calling the Multiplex Cinema. The Multiplex Cinema has five theaters with the best movies in town. Now showing in Theater One, The Spanish Dancer, a film from Spain about the life of the famous dancer, Carlos Montero. Showtimes are at 1.15, 3.30, and 7 o'clock. Now showing in Theater 2, 
When Are You Going to Call the Plumber? Starring Julie Richards and Harry Grant. In this comedy, a husband and wife have a lot of problems in their new house. Showtimes are at 2.30, 4.45, and 7.15. Now showing in Theater 3, The Fortune Teller. In this film from Brazil, a woman tells people all the things that are going to happen in their lives. Showtimes are at 5 o'clock, 7.45, and 10.15. Now showing in Theater 4, The Time Zone Machine, the exciting new science fiction movie. Professor Stanley Carrington's new machine can send people to different time zones around the world. Showtimes are at 5.15, 8 o'clock, and 10.30. There's also a special show at midnight. Now showing in Theater 5, Tomorrow is Right Now. In this new drama, a truck driver from Australia falls in love with a businesswoman from Paris. Where are they going to live? And what are they going to tell their friends? See it and find out. Showtimes are at 6 o'clock, 8.30, and 10.45. The multiplex cinema is on Harrison Avenue, across from the shopping mall. So come and see a movie at the Multiplex Cinema. You're going to have a good time. Thank you, and have a day. Global Exchange. I'm going to be very busy this weekend. On Friday evening, I'm going to get together with my friends from college. We're going to have dinner, and then we're going to a concert. On Saturday morning, I have to clean my apartment because my parents are going to visit me in the afternoon. In the evening, we're going to go bowling. On Sunday, I'm going to teach my Sunday school class in the morning. I'm going to a soccer game in the afternoon and I'm going to wash my clothes in the evening. How about you? What are you going to do this weekend? 